You want to take that shot. Um, you know, that's that's what you dream of. You know, growing up. You know, watching TV, watching the, uh, those guys. You know, that you look up to take those last second shots. That was supposed to be rad for Issa, and then if it didn't, if Issa didn't get it, Jill, Jill was supposed to come up and get it to get in the second shot. But then I, I felt like they doubled Jill, and Core was wide open, and then he just hit the shot. We decided, you know, get it up. You know, went in. You know, we were able to get it done in overtime. I felt like they knew that our inside defensive pressure was too intense, so they couldn't really come inside, so they kind of just settled, and that's what we wanted, that's what we wanted to bait them into, and I felt like that game plan just worked. Once you make a team play from, you know, the outside, it's kind of harder, you know, those pardons are great, um, great big down there, Fazon can stretch it out, so you, um, once we were able to lock them up, you know, we were able to get in their heads a little bit, and McIntosh was out, so it kind of made it easier, you know, they were going to run. Just the coaches, the head coach coming in, the assistant coaches talking to us, keeping us focused, Telling us we're still in the game, don't worry about it, and then us huddling up by the team, and just all of us bringing that energy together. It just shows us we have. Fight. It just shows us that the fight is that the fight hasn't stopped for us. We're still going through it. We got three more games left, so we just gotta keep fighting. We just gotta keep rolling. We get on the defense end um, first. You know, these last three games we really got out to a bad start, but after those bad starts, you know, we played good ball. So if we don't get to a bad start, I feel like you know we can we can be in a lot of games and we can win some more games. So yeah, we're gonna use this as some motivation and uh, try to keep it rolling.